Happy Monday, everyone! Today we're making cheesy garlic knots. These are delicious buns covered in garlic butter, uh, but we're gonna add some cheese into the dough too because cheese plus garlic butter equals the most delicious buns. <laughs> So we're gonna get started on our dough. Um, in here, I've got two cups of flour, and then I'm going to add one teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon instant yeast. I have two tablespoons of sugar, and then about half a teaspoon of garlic powder. You can also use just chopped up clove of garlic, or you can just leave that out if you don't want garlic in them at all. So I'm just gonna lightly toss this together just to mix the yeast in the flour. <laughs> Perfect. Oops, technical difficulties. Um, so to this, I'm going to add one cup of warm milk that I've melted three tablespoons of butter into. Dump that in. And then we're gonna mix it with our dough hook on the mixer until it comes a nice dough ball probably will be six to eight minutes, so I'll get that mixing. All right, our dough baby is looking good, so it's not sticking to the sides of our bowl, and it's all clumped together in the middle, so that's perfect. So we'll stop that. And then I've got half a cup of cheddar cheese and one tablespoon of Parmesan cheese, but use whatever cheese you got. You can use Swiss cheese, um, not a brie cheese. That would <laughs> probably be really messy. Um, but any kind of cheese you can grate is perfect. Or again, if you don't want cheese, just leave it out. It'll just be a delicious dinner roll. So I'm gonna leave this on speed one and I'm gonna dump in the cheese and just let it mix till it all gets incorporated. We got our cheese ball dough, cheese dough ball. <laughs> Awesome, so it's nice and soft and stretchy, but it's not sticking to my hands. So that's perfect, that's what we want. So we're gonna pop that into a greased bowl with a lid. I'm gonna let it sit at room temperature for about an hour or until it's doubled. And then we'll get to shaping them into our little knots. So we'll see you then. The little cheesy dough baby's all risen, so we're gonna cut it out now. So I'm just gonna put on my lightly floured surface. Press it down and then I'm gonna cut it into eight pieces with a knife or a bench scraper if you've got one. We just want them to be pretty similar in size. Ooh. Okay. And then you'll grab one piece, you wanna roll it into a wormy, about six to eight inches long. That looks pretty good. And now to knot it. So to do that, you're gonna take the two ends and wrap them around like you're tying your shoes, like so. And then these two ends, you wanna pull them together and pinch them. Then you have this cute little knot and we'll just put that onto a lined baking tray. So I'll just show you one more here. So two ends loop around like you're tying your shoes, like so. And then pinch the two ends together and then that's gonna go on the bottom. Ta-da! <laughs> so we'll roll all those out. Then I'm gonna cover them with a clean dish towel on top. Um, and then I'm gonna let them rise at room temperature till they're about doubled. So half an hour to an hour, just depending on your kitchen. We'll see you then. <laughs> Our dough knots have all risen. They look all poofy and adorable. So we're gonna um, brush the tops with garlic butter. I've also preheated my oven to 350, so it's nice and hot. Um, and for the garlic butter, I just melted two tablespoons of butter. I chopped up one clove of garlic, added a pinch of dried parsley and a pinch of pepper. Um, but you could just do this with straight up butter too. So you wanna glaze all of them with this delicious butter and then we'll pop them in the oven till they're golden brown. Probably will take about 20 minutes, but we'll see. 
So I'm just gonna brush these all and then get them in the oven. It's been about 23 minutes and our delicious cheesy garlic knots are all baked up so they're golden brown. If you pick one up and listen, sounds hollow so we know they're baked. Um, and I'm gonna just dig on into these delicious garlicky goodness. Um, so I'm gonna eat these. You guys have an awesome day. I will see you tomorrow and hope your day is wonderful.